yard pickup. It'll be second down and six. Clock running, 9.45 left to go in the game. Deck leading 12-7. Deck very quickly up to the line. Higgins out of the shotgun, takes the snap. And he'll give it to Dixon, running right, tries to get to the corner, but nothing there. He will lose a yard back to the 42-yard line. Lost his foot over there on the corner. And again, Dixon has problems getting to the corner. Yes, slants and dives. That yep. rascal is tough, tough. Now it's third down and six for Tech at the FIU 37-yard line. Higgins. Takes the snap, back to throw, looking, throws it out, it's caught at the 30, staying on his feet is Griffin, flags go down, Griffin stays on his feet and finally goes out of bounds inside the 25 to the 22, but all kinds of flags go down. I and think that's going to be uh, holding on Hunter Lee, who is over here on the yep. corner, trying to block. If so, that will negate the first down. Illegal block in the back by Hunter Lee. Yeah, and he's disgusted with it and has his hands on his hips. And uh, he was trying to block about two different people. There, and Griffin kept jumping out of arm holes, and it did not turn out well for the Bulldogs because that's going to be third and, what, nine? Third, about nine to go. Tech will have it at the 39-yard line of FIU. Just under nine minutes left to go in the game. Bulldogs would have to get to the 30 to get a first down. Higgins takes the snap back to throw, throws the screen. It's caught at the 40. It's Dixon at the 35, stays on his feet. He's Here at the go. 25, 20, 15, 10. Touchdown, Bulldogs. you got to love it. Well, Halley intercepted a couple of balls tonight, but he just got run over by Tech's best running back back at the 25-yard line. God love him. I'll tell you, when Dixon gets in traffic, he is at the best when yeah. he's in traffic. He is at his very you know, best. Yeah, his strides are shorter. He gets longer on the edge. But, man, when he's running it straight up, he is tough, tough. And he just ran over the strong safety. And now looks like uh, Tech may be calling a timeout here. Yeah, go for Bulldogs. uh leading 18 to 7. So the Bulldogs will take a timeout. We'll keep it right here. You know, we think this would be a discussion to whether to go for two or not. I don't know. Tech yes. leading 18 to 7. It's an 11 point lead. Even if you get the two point conversion, if you go for it, it would uh, still it'd be a, what, a 13 point lead. So two touchdowns and an extra point would still beat you. But the Bulldogs get their first touchdown of the night on a 39-yard pass that ends up from Higgins to Dixon. Hey, Dave. Yeah. First of all, what a, what a run. That's, that's why it's hard to get on to him when he fumbles and when he's trying so hard because he makes plays like that that uh, can obviously put games away. But uh, that was a heck of a play. And uh, it was fun. I was right in front of it, so it was fun to watch this close. But... Uh, you know, again, you look at it. You kick the you kick the extra point here. You're up 12. So then the uh, the field goal, the touchdown, the two point conversion don't mean anything. They've got a right. two score, two touchdowns. So I'll be interested to see what the Bulldogs do here. You know, and I I think I'm correct, Malcolm uh, Dixon. When he tries to get to the corner on those sweeps, it's he just doesn't have maybe the quickness. But when he gets in traffic, that's when he's at his best. Yeah, I know, and FIU's done a good job on the outside on him tonight, too. I mean, they've uh, they've done a good job of containing it. It's, it's when he gets up the middle and he gets that steam going uh, north and south instead of east and west that he's so tough. Tech's going to go for the two-point conversion with an empty backfield. With three wide outs to the right. Higgins takes the snap, throws it, and he throws it. Uh, a diving catch, catch by Sterling Griffin. No. What a catch. you got to love that. <laughs> I mean, there was a fade route. It looked like it was going to be five yards over his head, and Sterling Griffin made a diving catch in the backside of the end zone on a two-point conversion. The defensive back was wrestling with him. In fact, they've called a lady. It was a push. But he goes down to the ground. Griffin is stopped in his track, and it looks like he jumped off a trampoline to pick up this ball right before it hits the grass. And it's 20-7, to 7, Louisiana Tech, 
on the two-point conversion with Higgins throwing it to Griffin, but what an outstanding catch. Malcolm Butler, you were right there. I don't see how Griffin ever got to it. Yeah, he made he made a heck of a play. That DB went down, and uh, Sterling just launched himself, and that's uh, one of the nicer catches we've seen this year. And I'll tell you what, that's a big two points right there. Again, if, if that doesn't succeed, then all of a sudden it's a, it's a field goal, a touchdown, and a two-point conversion that could tie this thing up. So uh, that's a, a really nice play and a big play. Sterling Griffin was one of the guys in the halftime locker room that uh, was really fired up uh, with the offensive unit for having to settle for field goals. So uh, nice to see him make a play right there for his team.